Hi, thanks for joining to another work trade video. Today, we will review how customers with login access, better known as trackers, can keep track of the progress in their work orders and also how they can submit work orders. Before starting, I want to thank Queen City Commercial Services for suggesting this video. By this point, your account administrator should have sent you a verification email and your login credentials. After that, you're ready to log into your work trade profile. Here's your tracker dashboard. Here, you will see all the work orders you have submitted and you will be able to keep track of any progress. You also have your settings, such as your information, your security settings, and your notification settings. You also have a help center that will have very important information on how to get started with WorkStrait, FAQs, and help with your work orders. Let's go back to the dashboard. And let's take a look at our work order. Here we can see who created the work order, what is the status, and who is the customer. I want to point out that the fields displayed on this work order are just an example. Remember that with WorkStrait, if you are a user, you have the ability to customize your work order form. You will find the video in the description box on how to customize your work order. Here we can see the title, service description, clocking time, and estimated hours. We also see the task section and the messages section. Now, let's move into creating a work order. Let's click on the Create Work Order button. We will find Title, the Description Box, the Priority, and the Attachment section. In this case, let's enter the title Cleaning Apartment 2C. On the Service Description Box, we will just repeat the title. We will set the priority to Medium, and create work order. After the work order has been created, the status is unapproved, which means that the company who is receiving the work order needs to approve it. We can also go to the messages section and attach images, files and PDFs with a limit of 10 megabytes per message. And this is how a customer with login access, better known as Tracker, can submit and keep track of the progress on their work orders. We hope you have found it useful and please do not hesitate to reach out to the WorkStrait success team with any questions or suggestions. Thanks for watching!